Hey, what's up? It's Kylie from SculptedMuscle.com, and today we're going to be doing something a little bit unorthodox. You know, people are constantly asking me how they can get in shape without resorting to joining a 12-month gym membership and without having to buy a bunch of fancy, expensive equipment that they have no room to store in their own house or apartment. And listen, I get it. You know, I know what it's like to live a busy lifestyle, and some days you just don't have the time to get in a full workout. But when those days do come, I have some great alternatives for you to use so you can continue to build on your gains, okay? Today, I'm going to show you how to use everyday home appliances like suitcases and towels to help build sculpted muscle tone and both your biceps, your triceps, and your shoulders. We're going to be doing four exercises in a circuit and we're going to cycle through twice. So the first exercise that I'm going to be doing here is called single suitcase bicep curls. Okay? As you'll see, I have a small suitcase, probably weighs anywhere between 25 and 35 pounds because it's packed. I'm going to grip the handle with my right hand. I'm going to simulate the same motion as a regular bicep curl with the dumbbell. Full extension, curling up as far as I can go, and then slowly coming back down until we reach a full extension again. Just like this. This is going to build the mass of the peak of the biceps, okay? So we're going to go 10 reps on our right side, and then we're immediately going to switch and do 10 reps on our left arm. Here we go. Right? Switching sides now. Same thing. Remember, full extension on every single rep. All right. So next, we're going to be hitting the biceps again. You see, I have a towel here. I'm going to tie the towel to the top of the suitcase, and this exercise is going to be called Towel Suitcase Curls, okay? We're going to grip the towel with our thumbs facing up, right? We're going to start with our arms fully extended, we're going to curl our hands about up to our chin level, and when we reach this point, we're going to rotate them outwards. Right? This rotation here is hitting the brachialis part of the biceps. This is an area that a lot of people neglect. And when you train it consistently, it's going to help you develop your biceps in a really short amount of time. So same thing. We're going to go for 10 good reps here. Try to go slow on these. really feel the tension when you rotate your wrists outward at the peak point of each rep. Try to keep your elbows tight too at all times. One more. Okay, so we've hit our biceps and now we're going to switch gears and target our triceps. Same thing, we're using the suitcase and the towel. We're going to grip the towel with our thumbs facing up and then we're going to hoist the suitcase in back of our head. Begin here with your elbows tight to your head. Try to keep them there at all times. And then you're just going to press up and at the peak point of each rep, you're going to rotate your palms outward. And this rotation here is going to be hitting the long head of your triceps, which is the largest and strongest subsidiary region of the muscle group. You're going to come back down as far as you can and continue to press up. And we're going to do this for 10 reps. So here we go. Try to do these slow for a couple reasons. Obviously proper form, but you don't want the suitcase to keep smacking you in the back of the head. Here we go, two more. All right. So, fourth and final exercise, we're going to be hitting our shoulders, specifically adding definition to our front and middle deltoids. We're going to be gripping the suitcase handle, 
fully extending our arms and in one motion we're just going to raise up to about our chin level and then continue to raise up above our head now a lot of people screw this up a lot of people limit the full range of motion they only come up to their head level now you'll get some results here right it puts a little bit of pressure on your shoulders but to maximize the isolation on your deltoids you really want to break the point of your head and continue to raise the suitcase up above your head as far as you can go so this is more of a toning exercise we're going to be keeping our reps a little bit higher let's go between 15 and 20 reps per set let's get after it Once again, that's going to be hitting our middle and front deltoids, really creating those defined muscle striations that's going to separate our shoulders from our upper chest. So we've cycled through once, we're going to go through one more time, starting with our single suitcase curls, hitting the peak of the bicep. Here we go, same thing, 10 reps. side. Good thing about this exercise, you can help spot with your other hand when you're reaching the point of exhaustion. All right, tying the towel now. Get a grip at the top of the towel with your thumbs pointing up, arms fully extended. Here we go, hitting the brachialis portion of our biceps now. 10 reps. right into our overhead suitcase extensions and our triceps now. Ending strong with our suitcase raises. Let's try to go for 20 reps here. Here we go. All right, so four different exercises from the comfort of our own living room. Uh, two exercises to build the peak and the brachialis of our biceps, then we hit our triceps, and we finished off by building sculpted muscle tone to both the middle and front deltoid regions of our shoulders. Listen, 
no excuses going forward. I completely understand if you don't have time to get in a full workout, but I know you have 10 to 15 minutes during your day to do a workout like this. I'm pretty sure you have a suitcase in your house or apartment, and I'm assuming that you have a towel. If you don't, you got much bigger problems than trying to get in shape, all right? Listen, be sure to leave a comment, let me know how you did, and for more free workout and nutrition tips, or if you wanna check out my full programs, go to sculptedmuscle.com. I'll see you in the next workout.